What's up folks? Welcome back, I'm Daily Fix. We are currently in a war against Austria thanks to Burgundy. He decided that it was a good time to attack. Uh, even though we are going to be out of the truces with Norway and Sweden, we have released Finland just for this war because we're going to be growing Finland. Uh, into Sweden and then we'll integrate Norway and stuff like that. We'll see how that will go. But first things first, we need to get out of this very, very annoying fight. Austria is doing something I really hate and that is just fighting this one fortress. So there's a truces. And you're going to start over here, slowly taking back territory. Oh no, mate, I'm not going to let you escape. You can trust that I will attack you. That's mountains. Not going to be attacking into mountains. That's hills. That's not even better. Stop. Please, stop. Because these guys are way too fast. Okay, we have uh, definitely we've captured one of them. Let's see what he does. That's just a simple wipe here. We're going to be moving back. There is not much else we can do in this region. Our allies will just... Siege everything back. Let's move over to this wood fort. And we're now on the chase. Yeah, we're on the chase. We're chasing them down. Let's get this Navarian thing going as well. Let's see. I want you to go over there. And you go towards the mountains. If we can take this province, it would be very nice to be able to fight in this region. Now, so we'll see each other. This is a gold mine, so I'm not sure why they are not going to take this. Uh, we want to land our troops on their capital. We can't move there towards... Can we just move over here then? Yeah, we'll do that. We'll get that mountain fort going. And they're landing troops on the Austria capital. Uh, Burgundy is getting siege down. That is not my problem. He is not enjoying this fight whatsoever. And I enjoy that he's not enjoying it. Uh, cross border into Sweden, huh? It's not my rebels. Can't really do anything about it. It's nobles. So I'm not sure what their problem is currently. We'll see. And we just wait here for the sieges. Uh, if we see a large army approaching, we do want to get rid of this. Uh, we want to get off this mountainous fort. But if we can take it, best bloody defense ever. Mountain fort. Just great. That is amazing. So, yeah, we're going to be taking territory here. Uh, and hopefully we can finish this war. And Burgundy needs to make the right decision here. I actually have a save file. So... If this does not happen, we might want to go back to that save file. There we go, that's one. And they are all being sieged down here. Let's split you up. Send you over there. Your time. Come on there. I can't move there. Actually, I can. Right now. Get over there. And get over there. Get over here. We'll carpet siege him a bit. Um, once the capital falls, that's pretty much it. And I don't see this war being lost anymore. We can always move our armies and just take back whatever it is they took. Uh, where's the most supply limit in this region? Man, that is really shit. 15 then, huh? Move you down back over there. 17, so once this goes, yeah, we'll just uh, move it into two stacks. There we go. Come on, just piece them out. It's taking way too long. And uh, we've got the fort over here. Uh, Alm is not part of Austria. And I think we are going to be moving this stack back. And we'll do the same with the other one as well. There's no real territory for them to retreat to. So if we can manage a good position. <sighs> I 
do I want this? The negative 10 to is quite nice, but we're kind of falling behind. Institution is increasing as well. So we would need 500. I kind of think we want to finish my ideas first. Let's get started on that. We might even get the Estates General uh, National Tax Modifier plus 10, which is, you know, not bad at all. And there is the Conquest as well. Uh, that is not in our favor. I think it's over here. So yeah, we'll send our uh, forces over here to counter theirs. So let's go. Two rems. It's time to actually deal with the Austrian armies. It's 99. The war's done. Come on, peace out. Peace out. There is no need to stay in this fight at all. Come on, mate. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. 11 favors. We could increase trust. Sure, one click, why not? Okay, so it's time for us to move... Group you guys up. Let's go over here. And get you guys over to that region as well. I want to go ahead and declare war on Norm uh, Norway. He is improved, so this, um, this union is secure. I kind of feel that we want to get rid of it. No, not get, getting rid of the Union, of course, but uh, we want to get rid of this guy so we can actually declare war once my guys get there. You guys go to over that region. And I need to mothball my forts, all four of them. Okay, what else is just costing me money? Rooting out corruption, still six. We are down to 1.77. Uh, let's lower our army maintenance for a bit. If we can get the Burgundian succession right now, then that would be great. Okay, group up. Let's heal up those ships. And we are... Mm, yeah, let's wait for one tick. There you go. So my ships are healed. We're going to be sending my guys. Supply limit of 27. And this army is 29. It's not that bad. Over here. And we'll definitely... I don't know if we want to call on, on Sweden. Or just attack, like, for the reconquest and calling in Norway. He has no other allies, so this should not be that difficult a war. And we can just give this all to Finland. Grow his. And we might want to move one of my traders over here just to send into the English Channel. But I would rather do that the second we get the... Uh, Burgundian succession. Also, all of my guys almost love me enough. Let's summon the diet. Norway is subject of France. You know, there might not be such a bad idea. Let's do that. Let's give me your territory, mate. Here we go. So we'll move our troops over there and we'll call a war against Sweden. We need to wait to get more stability. Hmm. There you go. So moving my guys over there. And the second we got one army over here, I think we can safely declare this war. <laughs> oh, this is so damn good. What happened? Let's take a look. So they got all of it. It's an inheritance. And we, yeah, it is a personal union with us. This is this is amazing. We got Burgundy. Let's save. Okay, I'm, I need to save this because, oh my, if, if I mess up again. Uh, okay, sorry, for, sorry I'm doing this on cam, but I'm way too excited not to. So let's go to my save files here. Uh, let's reload this one. This is 1555. Okay, let's uh, copy. And paste into a copy and say cut. Backups. This one can go. And there we go. We got a copied version of the, um, the Iron Man that we're playing because 
Oh hell, I can definitely, definitely mess this up, guys. And I don't want to because it's quite nice to actually have those guys. How can we make more money? Because... Oh! oh. Nice! Oh, that's brilliant. Brilliant. Uh, this is absolutely fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. That's Naples. He's friendly with us. He's building up forces. Here is Burgundy. 27 troops uh put you on siege all of you uh, we can siphon income from these guys if we would like to um that's a hundred and thirty that's a lot that is a lot we kind of don't want to we, we could we could we can take this land at some point uh we definitely want to go ahead in this war we have burgundy now burgundy can uh, austria has declared us a rival speaking of rivals uh, we have the Mamluks and we have Russia. Let's go and do uh, Austria as well. Castile, we could improve relations with, but we need our guy. So once these guys get dropped over there, it is wartime. And I'm going to leave my forts inactive. It's not going to do that much though. Oh, we're just starting to lose claims over here. Let's take a look. So, we can root out at negative 10. So, we, we'd have a, just a bit more of a buffer. But it's not going to be enough to keep us into, like, the negatives here. Or out of the negatives. Uh, we're going to be subjugation. The subjugation of them. Sweden is, Sweden is not even in. Sweden is not in. There we go. That is the easiest war ever. We need to wait here because of my uh, money situation. Move you over there. So, another subject. Reaching us. And Burgundy and Scotland are going to be fighting. We're going to leave the guys together for a while. Uh, it's just 6k. So, maybe not. Let's go over there. Start sieging down this, uh, this fort. Can I just split you? You go over here. Um, we'll attack the 6k. We do need a general in there. Man, that is really strong, actually. Uh, soon, we want to improve Scotland. Let's take a look at Scotland, actually. Country development, Scotland. So, Scotland currently has 34 death. And uh, we need 70, so we definitely need to give him some land. Let us uh, go. Or oh, we can just bypass this fort? No way. Are we able to bypass this damn fort? Yeah, my dogs are really annoying lately. They fought a few times, which is not ideal. Let's get salad in there. Get over there. And we can detach for siege here. And we'll siege down this. We'll split this into two armies. You go over there. We can reinforce that way. He's not going to attack us. Look, he's not doing jack about this. Uh, next time we can actually go for Sweden. <laughs> My wife is really doing uh, the best job ever trying to train my dogs again. Because I don't know what the hell happened. We got two. We got two dash wounds. So there are a lot of barks going on all day. Uh, which is not going to happen. This, this we're not going to accept that. They. No. No, that is not happening, mate. Uh, it's group up. We have still a army in here. Burgundy is ours. They won't declare war on us. There is no way in hell I will let Burgundy go. Move you over there. It's almost done. This fight is almost over. Uh, once we take the capital and wipe out that li the tiny, tiny army. We can actually grow Norm Norway. No, if I have to choose, I would definitely grow Sweden. Sweden has better combat abilities, I believe. Let's take a look here. So, offensive ideas, ship durability, yeah, that's about it. Not the most interesting at all. 
Kom maar voor die twee. Keep those ships over there. Okay, that's done. 75. Let's send you over here. And can we already do this? What would happen? How bad? It's actually only England, Norway, and Denmark. No one else. Absolutely no one else cares. So we might just... Let's wait here. Let's take a look. How bad? So it's it's Sweden and Friesland as well, and we don't have to deal with Norway. I'll well, fail the agenda. Uh, you know, it's way less just to make it a vassal. And he will start building, he will fight against uh, Sweden with us. Uh, we definitely want to get rid of the Savoy. How is the reformation going actually? Do I want to flip Protestant right now? Got a lot of cardinals here. Um, the cure controller is Burgundy. Interesting. And Castile is the defender of the faith. Maybe it's better if we just remain Catholic. For now. Is there anything we can focus on? Join the Reformation, Reformed and Jigglar side religion. We can do religious wars. Hmm. It would probably piss off the entire country, uh, the entire world, because now, oh, they're starting to siege down. That is annoying. Um, we've renewed loans. That is not good either. We definitely want to get rid of the loans. So, any reason why you not want to do this? Because of this one forward, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, we're going to be sending these guys. Let's group you up. Uh, let's go deal with them. Let's go deal with them. So, I think I... Let's go with Siege Ability. Once those troops are gone, uh, we do want to get that um, royal marriage going again. A uh, peace offer from Norway. You know, mate, that ain't happening. You know that, right? And he's now idle. Nobody is that pissed at me. He's actually accepting that. We're going to take all of your money because you cost me quite a bit and you are now my vassal. So, yeah, he's going to be pissed forever. But that's fine. That is fine. Uh, now they're rebels, right? Oh, no, that's actually his troops. One, do we want to declare war on Sweden right away? I want to get at least one on Outraged and we'll do one on Allies for now. And after declaring, we will build up against Norway. How are the estates doing? So they are actually quite happy that we did what we did. But we need to get rid of Savoy. Let's insult him in four days. Let him break that uh, royal marriage. There we go. We still have one open slot. There we go. Norway, we do need to improve on the He has a high liberty desire. Let's take a look. Two days. If we declare war, England will join and the Lithuanian order. Uh, Burgundy, we can just... I kind of don't need that. If I attack him, Sweden would not join. But I would be breaking a truce. Annald and Oldenburg, we need to break those alliances. Yeah, we can just hold... We can do a reconquest then. 
We don't have to care. We can actually send these troops over to England and just beat the crap out of them. England can still wait. We don't need to do this right now. We would reset the truce because the truce is still till 1514 or 1515. So if we send these guys over here, uh, we'll land our troops over there. So we can immediately attack into like everything else but and then siege London down last. Uh, let's do that. Uh, we do need to uh, build up some more points. I would like to get more stability. Uh, we are making money, but that is never going to be enough. Uh, Norway is just going to be out of cash. That is uh, the way it is. Uh, one of my advisors died. Damn it. Why would you always die when I need you the most? You are all level 2. Very annoying. Did not mothball my forts. Okay, we'll have to deal with that for a second. I can't really send him away. Because he's just too expensive. I would have no cash. There's my ships. Let us send him over this region. So we can actually move into England. Marriage offer by Finland. I will accept that. We might get a personal union out of this. Come on, lean at level 1. This is just too expensive. Who's, who can we send away? This guy is... Not too expensive to send away. Maybe we'll get a level 1 here. National armor. I will take it. It's not the best, but still. Um, lose 1 corruption. Oh, yes, please. Yes. Oh, completely forgot about integrating this fella. So, let's annex. And we're still improving here. I want to get rid of my ally guy for now. Because we need to declare war in a second. On Sweden. Let's move these guys closer to each other. Let's get envoy traveling time. And we'll get the March, March of Lords. I kind of do want to get Sweden, but first we'll grow in Finland. How's my aggressor expansion? Yeah, might be, a, might be an issue soon. Uh, at, at least I'm going to get England into this. So there's not going to be a coalition anytime soon. If I declare war here, England will join as well as the Lithuanian order. Like, I don't really care about the Lithuanian order. Um, Poland's not interested by the looks of it. And we want to go for... Verberg here. No, something easier. Like Austin Button. Uh, England's definitely going in. Let's confirm this. Here we are. My poor fleet... ...is fighting. Let us immediately go over there. Turn a blind eye. And uh, we captured two more light ships. Let's go to Cornwall. Okay, stop. Let's uh, detach. And he's moving over there, which is good. We'll wait until he's locked in. Then we move into the, the woods over here. Come on, where are you going, mate? Lock in. There you go. Wait, where where are you going? You're locked in. Okay, I um, guess it's me. Guess there's not going to be a fight. There was no fight message whatsoever. Uh, let's go detach. Detach and detach. Pause the game. And uh, we'll send our 24 over to Derby. Go into York. Can we detach, please? Dude, seriously? 
You don't want to listen. Why? Well, whatever then. Go. He did not want to listen. Because it's already there. I was on the wrong map mode. You guys go to London. We go over here. Because he is moving... Let's see where you're going. Uh, let's wait. And take this in friendly territory. And that is the army of the English. So the English, no more. You guys go over there. And we have these two lights. Let us get this guy away. Group you guys up. So once the war is done, that will be over. We did not really participate in the area up here. Let's see. There's just one fort over there that's being sieged. There's another one down here. And that's a level one. So we can just deal with the Lithuanians over there. Of the uh, Lithuanian order. Uh, yeah, he's sieging down Finland. That's not a big ass problem now, is it? Where are you going? Where are those troops? Are they back in there? Because I should have seen this by now. Uh, we are fighting rebels, it looks like. Let's detach and... Can't really move in. Okay, let's keep them together. And we'll, uh, we'll uh, slowly siege all of this down. Let's go take that so we have more tax. Still losing a buttload of money, and this is way too long that I'm, I'm not going to deal with that. Yeah, we we'll do want to deal with these troops here. Coast is being raided. And I don't need that. Okay, you, detach, go here. Yeah, look how long this takes. Go here. This is mountains, I think. Yeah, but it's two. Two thousand. Oh, Take that. Definitely take that. Military leader has left us and is falling ill. Let's use him. And we'll hunt him down. We'll um, go back down here. Let's move you down here. Let's see what he will do. That siege is done. That's great, actually. Uh, one, two, three, four. So you go here, you go there, you go here, you can do it. Go. We'll keep these guys together so they won't lose the second they do anything. Move you down there. There is the fight. Integration is a slow process, so that's done. Liberty Desire by Norway. Well... Let's deal with that. He doesn't want to royal marriage us. Pause the game here for a second. Let's improve your relations. And... Group you guys up. Send this guy back to improve with Castile. And they cannot land troops, so that's good. And we'll siege down Sweden. Kill his troops. There is going to be a fight, but he's going to be reinforced. That's being done. Never mind then. Not a fight. There is... Let's go there. Even though they will win, it's still quite annoying. We need to send the troops over there. Liberty Desire is quite... No, we are actually making good money now. Interesting. The corruption is almost done as well. So, yeah, that's going to be another free. Oh, I can't wait until we actually pay off our debt. Because that is just too annoying. This is annoying as well, though, but still. We'll just siege all of this down. Okay. You go here. You go there. You go here. You go here. Uh, England. He's our idol. He wants out. Oh, we're going to be giving... You're going to give me cash, mate. Negative 20. Once we get London, we are going to demand... 
war wraps and i want you to steer trade like it's going to be a massive one that we have to wait until we integrate england that's not a huge problem did scotland by itself do anything no that is a bit bad it's kind of hoping that he would so we're going to be giving this territory back to finland make make finland strong again you know that's going to be the phrase of the century i feel like <laughs> let's go you go over there yeah, uh, we do need to deal with them. Naples is doing nicely. Uh, Sweden is being annoying, like always. That's uh, a group up. That was actually rebels. I don't see them. But you guys actually wait here. We're going to give you a general. Uh, move over there. Oh, uh, yeah, we'll deal with the uh, Swedish troops. There are not a lot of them. I'll take that. Take the mercantilism. This one is done. Let's go over here. Let's take the war goal. Unsiege the rest. And you will deal with some more of these troops. And then we actually almost have all of this. Which is quite nice. And Burgundy is ours. Sacking of London. Oh, I love it. Let's take that. Take London. We are going to be taking a loan. At least they think we are going to be taking a loan. Sue for peace. There we go. We're still going to take a loan though. But war reps. War reps is quite nice. We are going to be... Shall we transport our ships? Is it going to be safe? Where's my ships? They're down here. I think it's safe enough. Go. So the truce now changed till 1523. It is what it is. No problems there. And uh, we got another advisor dying. Shit. Um, let's take him. The leader should actually just die already. Move over there. Move over there. Let's end this war right now. And uh, we are improving with Norway and we need to get one on Outraged. Because they will be Outraged. And we're on 32 minutes again. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'll uh, hope to see you next time. Don't forget to like, comment, maybe subscribing, whatever. Do whatever you think is, uh, is helping my channel, you know? So, see you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.